Thank you for coming to our booth. Um, we are very pleased uh, to announce that you know what you see there, the aero bar, the flying bar, is a real good concept. We had the idea uh, five years ago. We started the first one, the Futuroscope, and uh, since when it's a huge success. As you can see, it's thrill because people can fly up to 35 meters high, 100 feet high, 120 feet high. It's emotion because you have an amazing view, and it's conviviality. It's a French word to say you share a drink with people and you have time with others. And this concept, very new concept, uh, we started in uh, we started in Futuroscope with uh, George Alexandre, which is there. And George Alexandre, our client, started Futuroscope in 2000, uh, 2013, and then uh, Dubai and uh, Park Asterix. Uh, uh, 18 months ago and Pakistan and Dubai it's such a success then we are glad to announce today that George Alexandre bought a second aerobar in Dubai okay so this is the news the concept works so well that only after 18 months on one ride because it's only one ride uh, we can we have uh, we have the proof of concept and we can start a second aerobar in Dubai. So on our side, Aerofil, who are the manufacturer of the, of the aerobar, we have sold so far 12 and we have four more in order. So what we want to tell you is that uh, the, way of, uh, the way of having rides are changing and the fact to add food payment, to have drink payment is very good and we think it's a good way to add new ride into the city, into the shopping mall, and into, uh, into the, the amusement park. George Alexandre. Well, thanks so much for the introductions. Yes, we are, we are very glad to partner with Aerofield and uh, having now uh, four aerobars. So we have one in Futuroscope, one in Asterix, one in Dubai, and the second one in Dubai. And of course, doing business in Dubai, is, as you know, is, is a bit different than in France. But I think the, um, the Aerobar fits very well the purpose of the new change uh, of tourism. It's now mass tourism. People want to have fun. But not necessarily in the amusement park, but everywhere. So when you have a great location with the view, I think the view is very important. I think they will enjoy something relatively quick. It's 20 minutes experience. But a very fulfilling as you will have the view, the thrill of, uh, of the ride and also the drink. So the combination of the three is, uh, is very attractive. Uh, we have a huge uh, customer satisfaction. Everyone's enjoying it. Uh, that is, is, a, is a real success. And for the new people coming to Dubai, which is uh, the tourism is moving more to a mass tourism, they need something relatively quick and you can have the view, the experience and the drink. So it's quite appealing for the, for the change uh, of, you know, of, of, of tourism in Dubai. And, and, and I think we have space for a second one at the opposite of the site. We partner, we partner with Miraz, uh, which is the uh, you know, property company of Chet Mohamed. So the, uh, yeah, very, the ride is, is working very well, uh, even on the tough conditions. I mean, Dubai is 50 degrees uh, during the summer, but we walk more late at night and people are used to it. So I think that's, um, that's a unique experience. We like, we like to be unique. And I think the Middle East region overall is a very good region for such uh, ride. And we are glad to announce today on top of the uh, acquisition of a new aerobrad partnership we have with Aerofield to develop more within the region of the Middle East. We believe that uh, there is a lot of potential for such experience in that region. And the fact that you, know, you can walk every day, uh, every single day of the year we are open, and people enjoy our ride, it's very unique. Uh, in comparison to amusement park in France, where we have some downtime during the winter because you have nice river uh, all, year, all year round. I, so, I, yeah, I think that's. I, the, I think it's quite unique that only 18 months after the first one, you buy a second ride, you know, on the same place. I don't know a lot of examples, a stand alone attraction. So, only 18 months after the first one, the return on investment was so high 
then uh, George Alexon can invest in a second one. So this is really the proof of concept. I told you what are the advantages for people who ride the, the ride, hello Susie. But also, it's also a very easy ride to operate for the company. Very small footprint, so a very limited rent, and very small uh, maintenance, very easy to maintain, because the speed of the aerobar is very slow. So you don't have a lot of wearing or things you have to change. So you, you invest for once, and it's forever. And third, uh, the cost of investment is really, really uh, reasonable compared to a big Ferris wheel or to a, even big things. So you can have a very cheap, very easy to maintain and very efficient object that you can add everywhere you have a nice view. So with uh, George Alexander, we, uh, we had uh, Dubai, but we also sold in Tulum, in Mexico. We had sold in Seoul, in South Korea. We had sold in Dalian, in China. And in France, we have four of them, Futuroscope, uh, Parc Asterix, Parc du Petit Prince, and near Nantes on the west of France. So I think, you know, we, we uh, developed a new concept, a real new concept of amusement, where you have both amusement and drinks, drinks and beverage. And we see a lot of development to that. So this is why we wanted to announce that today as a, a great achievement for our company. So thank you for, for your attention.